lovely. I really like to put a worse photo than that. We're looking for this young uh, female right here. Um, it is spotted. But this is one of the youngsters from Corolla. Corolla female is one of the female that have two youngsters. The other one we was talking with South and Peter we decided to give the name because of the way actually they react from Jeffa. The other one calls her I mean Saseka. The other one would like to call it in Ghana because it's much relaxed uh, from Jeffa itself. This one is a lot more relaxed as you can see. It's chilling out, lying down, look at the Jeffa. She doesn't have uh, to run away from the Jeffa. Lovely. And you can really understand the word Saseka. Saseka means beautiful. As you can see, she's a lot more beautiful for us. She's not grumpy. She's giving action. Sometimes if you follow up on this youngster, she's now and then going up into the trees, running, jumping. It's giving a lot of uh, actually actions. It's amazing. You can see leopard in a daily basis, you never ever get caught. One of the species is a lot more beautiful, and also by understanding now that leopard is very strong and to see into the area because it's a solitary animal, they're always alone. Get to see it, we always rejoice. one of the sun. All of them are running animals or cats or anything. It will give you a sign of yawning. It's so really to activate the body. They have a membrane called suspicious round membrane which is attached from the head all the way down to the tail with the feet and also go down to the vocal box. It's a little bit like a lateral line of the bone that really found on all these animals. So it's Yawning is to activate the body, stretching also part of it. Uh, it really tells the brother that she can really up on the move. She might move. Mainly you tend to see all these species. For the third yarn, she just stood up and moved. It's very common to see leopard doing that. See leopard doing that, as you can see stretching there. And the third one is there. You have to see what she's going to do. She might jump down and stretch and move wherever she want to go. So it's, it's very common. It could be four, four times, fifth times, but it's very common for a leopard. If you do that for the third time, get moving. Same as lion, same as cheetah, same with everything. You do the same. They get there. And shuffling the clock against the tree trunk is very common. Just activate the sun special and membrane that they have to tell the brother that they're getting up and moving. Most of the time, it's really it's where they might try to hunt and do something else. Look at that 
pattern of behavior. It might be spotted something that is a body language of seeing something that you might be interested to own. And she might follow up on that. Beautiful. 